gunfire and fear. On the streets of Stepanakert, the main city in Nagorno-Karabakh, panic took over as mortars pounded its surroundings. This ethnic Armenian dominated enclave and self-declared breakaway territory is internationally recognized as part of Azerbaijan. But it is controlled by ethnic Armenians and has close links to the Armenian government. It is the source of instability and tension between the two countries. And the threat of out-and-out -out conflict is never far away. Both have gone to war over the region in the early 1990s after the fall of the Soviet Union and in 2020, which ended after a ceasefire agreement. The latest source of tension is the continuing blockade by Azeri forces of the Lachin Corridor, an area of land linking Armenia to Nagorno-Karabakh, preventing those living there getting essential supplies such as food and medicine. <laughs> Russia, one of the backers of the ceasefire, has urged the two countries to stop the fighting. Russia strongly encourages the conflicting sides to stop the bloodshed, stop the military actions at once and return to a political and diplomatic settlement. Outside the Armenian parliament in Yerevan, crowds gathered to protest against the renewed military operations, urging the government to do more to protect the people in Nagorno-Karabakh, as once again, the tension between the two countries spills over into conflict. Sonia Gallego, Al Jazeera. Make sure to subscribe to our channel to get the latest news from Al Jazeera.